Can I run a one minute ad break when I come back on? <laughs> Hopefully that's a tiny bit better. Streamlabs just needs to be refreshed. I just opened it. I just lowered my bitrate by a lot, so I don't know if it's gonna lead to a lot of fucky shit. I really don't know what's gonna happen. My internet connection's kind of poopy. It's very annoying, and especially having people in... What's my bitrate at? 3,500. I wish it wasn't. Maybe I should have like a... Maybe I should turn it down to 60 frames. I think it's fine now. I'm no longer dropping any frames, and I'm having like a consistent frame rate as a uh, bitrate as well. Rip. Yeah, my, my bitrate's sucky. But I think everything's okay now. That's so low. Yeah, Australian internet pain. Anyway, we have the possibility of meeting up with Sojiro or going to talk to this street orator guy. Who is pretty epic, I'm not gonna lie. Um, what's his, what's his, uh, I'm, pr I'm gonna go do that. I just need to remember what's his, oh, I, I, I don't even, that's right. If it's the first time I'm meeting him, I should be fine. This guy, mm -hmm. I'm gonna go talk to him. Please consider what I have to say. You. Ah, am I interested in politics? I am. Are you a student? Mm -hmm. Oh, have I seen you somewhere before? Oh, you were working at the beef bowl shop before. You have a lot of perseverance for a young person. If you'd like. Well, if you're interested, I could use your help. I want to change the state of this country, and to do so, I need the power of youth. However, due to cer certain regulations, I can't offer a job to a student. I was thinking you could learn some things if you chose to attend a few of my speeches, though. I'd be glad to. Really, that would be helpful indeed. Well then, would you mind telling me your name and contact information? You're a student from Student Academy, hmm? It's nice to meet you. It's your- it's... Toronos- I- I- Yosh- uh, him. <laughs> I used to be a member of the Diet, but no longer. In the past 20 years, I've lost seven straight elections. This isn't good, I'm dwelling on the negative right before my speech. Very well. Well then, I hope I can count on your help immediately. This guy is... Cool. Everyone. The lines of what is considered right and wrong in society today have been blurred. With common sense no longer our guide, we make decisions based on our selfish wants and desires. This has resulted in a deluge of self-censored people who delight in taking advantage of the weak. However, However in this modern... Even in this modern day and age, it is imperative that we act, act in the best interests of all. I'm gonna lurk. Good luck roiling those personas. Okay. A world where it is acceptable to trample on the rights of others for your own benefit. A world where the young exist only to be exploited is a world that must be changed. Hmm, <laughs> easy for him to say. Old timers like me have our hands taking f have our hands full taking care of ourselves. He's actually making some good points, but he's a no name. He probably won't get too far. Nothing's going to change, we'll just keep getting exploited. What's this wannabe politician blathering about now? He isn't even affiliated with a party. How about you just leave matters of the state in the capable hands of the Liberal Co-Prosperity Party? You mustn't base your decisions on whom to support merely according to the party they belong to. Ah, uh, just shut up already, you're just a washed up politician. If I am chosen to represent the will of the people, then I am fully prepared to, in the best interests of all, <laughs> save the blathering for when you get elected, IF you get elected. That's a yikes. Thank you. That is all for today. Well, what did you think of my speech? The best interests of all? I'm glad. Do, you, do you feel the same? Such as such as I am, I'd like to believe that I'm capable of giving such a moving speech. I, <laughs> However, there are times like today when the audience has a different of, difference of opinion on a topic. Some feel I should concentrate on getting elected before I worried about others. Do you agree? You have my support. Thank you. Thank you. It's encouraging to know that my message has won you over. Besides, I've grown, grown quite accustomed to those types of reactions. No. Although, I don't know if that is necessarily a good thing. Regardless, no matter what they say, I must continue on. 
He's a bro. Well, then, I shall see you again soon. Perhaps I'll ask for your impression again sometime. He's cool. He's a chill dude. He's vibe. He's an epic man. It looks like you're attending school seriously. What's that supposed to mean? You also seem pretty close with Takamaki-san if you're both coming to school together. We catch the you same just train transferred line. transferred here, though. I guess you two really click. Yeah, we were in the same class. She sits in front of one seat in front of me. I see. You seemed a lot closer than that yesterday morning. Yo, don't I heard she things. was a victim of Mr. Kamashita. But was that all there was to it? Either way, closer inspection should clear everything up. Goodbye. Hurry up then. <laughs> Exams? Tomorrow? I just realized. Uh oh. <laughs> oh no! <laughs> Exams start tomorrow. Are you all ready? Oh Shall fuck. Uh, now then, picking up from the last time. The end of the Heian period marks the rise of the samurai, which I'm sure you've all been waiting for. As described in the tale of the, I don't know, heat, hike? It was a time when all that was great would fall from grace. It wasn't unusual for the heroes of yesterday to be struck down as rebels of the present day. By the way, sympathizing with the loser or the weak is called magistrate's patronage. That term came from Minamoto no Yoshitune's position, and it also became a way of referring to him as well. <laughs> Alright. Uh-oh. Who's this Do guy? You know Do you know the time period Yoshitune was active? You know? Uh, was it the Heian period? That's what that's what he said. Yeah. <laughs> this is it. Correct. That's right. I was correct. He supported his brother Yoritomo in during the Heian period. But despite his contributions in defeating the Tyra, he was driven out of his brother. He was driven out by. He was driven out of his brother. He was driven out by his brother and ultimately executed. However, in the centuries that followed, Yoshitune became more popular as a tragic hero. Give me my knowledge up. Give me my point. How am I not level 2 yet? This is bullshit. Rather than siding with the one who has overwhelming power, people preferred the underdog opposing them. It's sort of like rooting for a minor league baseball team instead of an all-star major league one. I can understand that. It's like, if I don't root for them, who will? Mood. MC Howdy. McHowdy? What are your thoughts? If you're confident in your exams, you could always liven up the day and head to Mementos. I do not want to go to Mementos. Oh, let's go, Ryuji. He's just asking me to go drink. He's asking me to go drinking. Oh, I can't hang out with him. This is so sad. Hey, it's not behind us before. Yeah, you know, I... As, lo as long as it stays at a at a decent at a decent bit rate and I'm not dropping frames it's like staying at a constant bit right now like I lowered my bit rate a bit and hopefully it's a little more smooth it's not gonna stop it's not gonna buffer as much now yeah it's pretty good that that means so much yeah look at me I'm rank six with Ryuji I, I gotta wait. But I'm only rank one with on. Uh, I got a lovers. I could go chill with on. Let's go chat. Here's a hoping. I'm hoping it's hoping, hoping well. Hello, on. It felt like someone was watching me this morning. Hmm. What should I do? Maybe it wouldn't hurt to at least ask. No, but then. Don't worry. I have... I'm level 2 kindness. I believe in your Wi-Fi. It's not Wi-Fi, it's Ethernet. Tell me about your problems. If it keeps fuck it up, you should beat it up. But then I won't have any internet. You're so reliable. Let's go. I'm a reliable person. She thinks I'm reliable. Thanks. Pull a Tim. I can't do a Tim. Yo, by the way, where are you two right now? I just beat up Kamoshida. So I'm like, I'm literally like 10 days after beating up Kamoshida. You can check out the the parts here on my VOD channel. 
Sorry about telling, not telling me about Kamoshida, but what? I was not paying attention. She's saying stuff about, oh, she her. It's she her. I went to visit her in hospital. She said she was sorry. Sorry for not telling me about Kamoshida, about all the things he was doing to her. But it was my fault too. I didn't realize how much trouble she was in. I wasn't there for her. So I apologized as well. Moobot? Yeah, I have, I have a bot to tell people, hey, I've got a Discord. She's so strong. <laughs> Isn't she? She really is a great girl. I'm fi I'm glad I got I finally got to tell her everything. I couldn't bring myself to say before. Hey. And um remember how Kamashida threatened to take Shiho off the team if I didn't sleep with him? I had only agreed to it that so that it wouldn't ruin Shiho's dreams. But now that I think about it, he never would have put her on the bench and cost his team games. I seriously should have dared him to try and take her starting spot. But in the end, maybe I just didn't believe in her ability. Kamoshida had the upper hand. That might have been true. But honestly, I think it was all because of how weak I am. That's why I believed Kamoshida's authority outweighed Shiho's own ability to earn her starting spot. Um. Do you remember the last time I talked to you like this? When I got that phone call from Kamoshida and cried. Yo, are those shady, shady cicada emotes? Epic. I felt so alone, scared even. But because you were there for me, I decided not to go. I was a little surprised at how pushy you were about it, but now I see. But I see now you just wanted to help. I got gifted to Sud for rating. Yeah, I, yeah, I was there. I was like, man, I should have spoken up and stuff. I would have gotten a free sub. It's sad. I couldn't just ignore you. You're so kind. Back then, people used to call me all sorts of names. Prissy bitch, Kamashita's girl. I got tired of it pretty quickly. But to tell you the truth, someday I want to be able to take labels like that in stride. Hey, hey I'm personas are the power of the heart, right? That means if my heart gets stronger, my persona will too. That's, yeah, that's sure. So I want to strengthen my heart, and I want to use that strength to help the people around me. I hope we can save people from trouble, just like we did when we changed Kamoshida's heart. Maybe another day? Yeah. Mm. Though honestly, I don't even know what strong is. But I'm gonna find the answer, I promise. Yo, what up, Sky? <laughs> you redeemed yo, what up? Let's find it together. We we have like that, that meme template. Yo, what up, Shinx? Thanks. Boom. It's like that meme template of the two like really muscly hands coming together. It's just like, we'll do it together. I guess that really doesn't count, though. Hmm. <laughs> well, I'll be relying on you. Let's train together and make our hearts super strong. Boom. Rank 2, baby. I need to get Ryuji to rank 8. I redeemed an emoji three times and I only got G's. <laughs> There's a limit for those? Yeah, no shit I'm gonna make- uh, No shit I'm gonna give a limit to something. I mean, they're free, so not getting any would mean you have a strong heart. Okay, hmm? is that not right? No, it's not. Bye. See you later. It's, a, it's an exclusive thing you can do once a stream. Doesn't it feel special then? And you don't have to say yo it up like 5,000 times, like a certain someone? Oh hey, it's me. Thanks for listening to what I had to say earlier. Royal content. Now I feel I now I feel like I have a better idea of who I want to be. Also, I'm going to think of how I can strengthen my heart. If I think of anything, I'll let you know. I hope you you'll join me again next time. Leave it to me. Yeah, I'm counting on you. You're such a nice guy. I'm a nice guy. <laughs> oh, how about you help me come up with ways to train my heart? Just let me know when a really good idea hits you, okay? Royal content. I need an alarm or something that I can play. Someone abuses a channel point reward. It sounds like they're being a little punk ass bitch that's gonna ruin it for everyone else. That's why you don't give them the option to ruin it like a little punk ass bitch that they are. I wonder if that you. Yeah, yeah, he probably is. Looks at you. You can't look at me. I have no webcam. Fool. <laughs> It's about, it's about preventing the alternative methods. Please I'm looking directly at say. you. No, you're not. I see all. 
Let's go. I want to learn how to give him speed. Teach you how to give speeches. Why? I want to be a politician. I'd love to help you, though. How should I teach you? It's time for my speech. Let's talk about this later. I choose not to see it. It's like playtesting. You want to fix the problems with the game. Voice? You want to fix the problems with the game without... They lack jobs, so, like, normal security, players don't do it, savings. you know? The next generation will lead us into the future, and yet they have no plan for how to arrive this there. This guy's great. Watch where you're going, you little shit. <gasps> no. You bumped into me, you old goat. Old this goat? Good. Uh, let's mediate. Yes, let's. Good citizens, please stop fighting. What is the point of bickering over such a trivial matter? This is none of your business. Yes, yeah, seriously, just shut up. <laughs> I like that shapeshift the song. Bring What's it back. This guy? It comes back every time now, if you'll please you excuse me, are chilling in your room. Together, we can create a bright future for the next generation. Ugh. God, so righteous. That really annoys me. That's not very nice. Enough of your arrogance, no good, Torah. Because if anyone would actually vote you bring for it you, back. are you planning to embezzle funds again, or maybe criticize one of your constituents? We're in again? doing a social link right criminal? now. Criminal. No, that that was all in the past. Calm down. Oh, I've gone and done it again. Uh, that's campaign obstruction. Yes, but I cannot say that to the crowd before an election. Regardless, whenever someone calls me no good Torah, I panic. I went through quite an ordeal 20 years ago. Mood? Let me explain. I used to be a member of the National <laughs> You're a criminal I same was elected bro. <laughs> during the rise of the Kuramoto. Yeah, show. did you know I had a cr I have a we criminal were record? By powerful diet members. This was about 20 years ago. I was very inexperienced back then, both as a politician as well as a human being. That inexperience led me to be involved in a series of major political scandals. Major political People scandals. People refer to my blunders as no good Torah's three strikes. Damn. The first was being caught missing a legislative meeting to take a personal vacation. Then, Why would you do that? I was accused of embezzling a large sum of money from the party. Why would you do that? Giving me two strikes. Finally, I called a voter an idiot <laughs> at an open forum, which resulted in scandal and strike free. <laughs> That's amazing. I was out <laughs> and branded a walk. Can you imagine, like, the president said you just calling someone an idiot openly on the street? But do you see the man before you? Prime Minister, whatever. Whoever is in charge, he has the con he has conviction and wants to change the world. I have conviction. Really want to receive my Why would you want to get caught embezzling money? Yeah, like, bruh, just don't get caught. You seem to have conviction. I'm happy to hear that. However, it's funny. <laughs> everyone says I have no chance to get elected. So why come to me? Cause you you have good speech. You talk You've good. Been giving speeches? I'm afraid I'm not so great that you'd be able to learn anything. Mm. Bro, your public speaking skills are the impressive. The important part about giving a good speech is believing in yourself. That's personally my motto. Perhaps one day I will believe in myself again. But so you, you sure don't? got me there. You're a strange young man. Thank you, Very I try. Well. If learning how to give a great speech is what you seek, then I'd be happy to instruct you. In exchange, I would like for you to continue assisting me. Let's get started, shall we? Let's go. Round two. Oh god, what did they put in that beef bowl? I too would like to get a criminal record for being a major political figure or calling a voter an idiot. That'd be epic. I time traveled into the future. Staging your crimes with calling cards. It's hard to believe that a student could manage this alone. No, it isn't. An adult. For example, someone talented enough to move people with words. Perhaps they coached you. No? 
I'm good at English, even though I didn't pass it. But I'm good at English and wording. That's something I'm good at. Anyway, we have the Sun Persona. Well, the Sun Confident. All right. So I really reaching right now. I know. dream of becoming a member of the This is a Brahmo. We've been talking for far too long. Yeah, it's like eight o'clock at night. Should probably go to get go to bed. You. You. <laughs> Me. I'm sorry. There's something I forgot to mention. It's about my speech schedules from this point on. Would you be willing to stick around and hear it? Of course. Thank you. Don't worry. It won't take too long. I'll be here giving my speeches every Sunday. <laughs> it's a fucking Tuesday. <laughs> You're welcome to drop by and help whenever you've got the time. Well then. That's all I wanted to say. Soon. Now, be careful on your way home. It's a fucking Tuesday. So I was like, who else can I indict for Avengers of helping this child? Yeah. Source, please. Can't believe this. A school assembly during exam week? What the hell are they thinking? It's the day after tomorrow, right? I wonder if it's going to be about Mr. Kamashita again. Uh, I can't believe the school is messing with our schedules like this. I don't care what it's about. It's going to have nothing to do with our students. I wish they'd, they'd stop dragging us into their mess. Seems pretty rough. A mandatory assembly during exam week, huh? Sounds rough for all of you. Ah, uh, yes. Maybe someone taught this kid how to speak good. With criminal intent, clearly. They didn't... They they would suspect our teacher. And that's not good. Well, oh, shit! Exams! What historical figure inspired the idiom of favoring the magistrate? It was... Uh... Oh, shit. Was it Yoshitsune? Yeah. It was Yoshitsune, right? Ooh, we can do this! An essay question. It looks tough, but let's calm down and think it through. Provide the reason why he's... Uh, he... It was, uh, Yoritomo. Uh, they ended up coming into conflict when they had to... They, uh, Yoritomo won. He committed suicide after being exiled. Uh, and they simplify more with the weak. Not just any weak person, though. People love rooting for an underdog who stands up to their powerful oppressors. And Yoshitsune did that to his brother. So the reason yeah, Yoshitsune is treated as a hero is because he stood up against the powerful Yori Yoritomo. Yep. I did it. <laughs> Exam complete. 100%, baby. Because I'm a genius. And I, I memorize, like, really stupid things. Let's get started. Okay, second day. Which brain function is responsible for the phenomenon of seeing an illusion in this figure? It's cognition. Ooh, we can do this! Ooh, we can do this! Which of the following maps can you paint without f any adjacent areas being the same color? Ah, oh, it's both? He, c he clearly couldn't have learned it from a teacher. Clearly, it was a random politician on the street. Specifically, this no good Dora guy who has a criminal record exactly the same as him. They would relate to each other so well. We achieved, uh, we achieved exam. Okay, class, let's get started. Exam three. Name the book that defied malfa uh, defined malfactor as the chief fact chief factor in the progress of the human race. It was Digital Devil Story. Bum, 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 the Devil's Dictionary. Ooh, we can do this. They bonded over their criminal records. If I had a criminal record. <laughs> like, you, like I would bond over people that had criminal records because like nobody else would understand the criminal records. Assault and political money <laughs> embezzlement are the same crimes, right? Uh, which character archetype refers to a mysterious and seductive woman, typically with alternative motives? Femme fatale. Ooh, we can do this. Exam three complete. Oh yeah, it's uh, it's school-wide assembly time. So that's the third exam done. Boom, I've done a hundred percent. Admin has to be trolling, dude. <laughs> Admin be trolling. Anyway, is this the is this what I think it is? It is. Ever since that specific Pog.
absolutely vital. So we've acquired the services of a therapist. Therapist moments. The floor is yours, Doctor. Best character moment right here. Here he is. Royal moment! Whoa, his voice is sexy. My name is. Uh huh? My name is Takato Maruki. <laughs> Maruki moment? Thank you for welcoming me to your school. <laughs> I love this guy. We got a therapist, baby. You can even call me Doc if that would help you feel more comfortable. Any assistance you need, I'll be. Oh. I guess I'm not really any good for helping with money problems. <laughs> he's, he's just like, fuck off. You get enough screen time. <laughs> Piss off. It's my turn. Yo. Yo, what up? You ever expect this place to actually give a shit about our mental health? I'm glad they do. Well, our schools made national news. Maybe they figured they'd look even worse if they didn't do anything for us. And Dr. uh... Dr. what's his name? Maruki. Maruki. Remember it, Ryuji. Yeah, wasn't that guy just basically clowning it up on stage? He's my do idol. You, you really think he'll do us any good? <laughs> a Royals Ryuji. version of this school is pretty smart to get a therapist. Hey Look at this dude. Sakamoto-kun and Takamaki-san, right? He knows who we are already. How do you know our names? Why do you think? Well, I was informed of certain students before beginning my tenure here. Those that had, uh, previous interactions with Mr. Kamoshida. It must have been especially tough for you after having just transferred- He was trying to be relatable, bro. He is very relatable. Uh, yeah, it was. I can't wait to- I can't wait to therapy that. it up with you. So, what do you want with us? Ah, uh, yes. I'd forgotten. I know I already offered my services to the student body earlier, but would you three be interested in counseling? You three specifically. Nope, not at all. Ryuji, bitch. Huh? How's that surprising? How, you, no, I'm you surprised. Just a touch more emphatic about it than I'd expected. Read your ah, bitch. Go to his therapy. You come to my office. You can have free snacks. He's even bribing you. you. Would be nice, but there's still plenty to be had. So, there be <laughs> Tell me more of these snacks. Hey, don't fall for that. I love this guy. To be frank, I've been explicitly ordered to provide counseling to the students directly involved with Mr. Kamoshida. It's in the school's interest. For its students. Fair. Ah, the school's interest, huh? Fair. I know that asking you to be open with a complete stranger like myself is a lot. Making this mandatory wouldn't do you any good either. Why are you so pissed at him, well Ryuji? Turn it into a worthwhile experience. Ooh. I know. If you attend my counseling sessions, I'll teach you different ways to improve your mental acuity. I need that. Like ways to hone your concentration before exams. That would be helpful, except we're in exams right now. Uh... But yes. Ryuji <laughs> being snacks. suspicious is fair. All right, no. All right, enough with the snacks. So, which way are you leaning? I'm going with the snacks. <laughs> <sighs> I guess it'd just be more trouble. And to ch leaving. hang out with this bro. Mm, yeah. Really? Then I guess it's a deal. He's a I'll bro. His office. Feel free to come by whenever it's convenient for you. Well, we should get going. Where are we going? Okay. I'll see you later. Where are we going? No, I want to vibe with him. Thanks for taking my counseling into consideration. This snack. Now that we have a deal, I promise I'll do my best to help you. Thanks, Maruki. You're 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 a real bro. Oh my God! What did you put in those snacks, Maruki? I'm time traveling. Maruki, best boy though. Hands down. It's hard to believe an ordinary high school student could accomplish such grandiose heists. Yeah, One when would need a heart of steel, unaffected by outside influences, and prepared to act without hesitating. 
You really put there my. There has to be someone who helped strengthen your mental state. <laughs> Marky, bro, like I'm going. In, you know? I'm going forward in time. Help me, bro. Give me a name. Why do you want to know the name of my therapist? I am with the birth of the counselor. It's the counselor persona. The new social link. All right. Introduced into Royal. So hold up, dude. I'm vibing with the doc over here. This. Well then. Bro, don't don't complain. Never complain, Maruki. <laughs> well, never apologize, Maruki. Okay, you can complain. Clearly, your therapist was helping with criminal intent. <laughs> oh, I. The counselor will be available to you s starting after school today in the nurse's office. He'll only be posted here through November, so be sure to speak with him soon if you feel the need. We are going to vibe. For the majority of you, it's your choice whether you see him, whether or not you see him. But there are a few students I'll speak with later. The school's decided visits to the Dr. Maruki will be mandatory for these individuals. Me, baby. You guys are gonna go for it? Yes. Let's do it. Let's go to therapy. <laughs> Make sure you visit him. I am going to visit him. He is a bro. Here he is. Yes. Is it just like it's immediately on? Welcome. Are you here for a counseling session? Yeah. Is now a bad time? <laughs> not at all. It's always a good time, so long as I'm not already already listening to a student. Temporary counselor fucked up. What's your? They're counseling. He's counseling for the people affected with by Doc, uh, Mr. Kamishita. I'm so glad you're here. Care for a snack? Well, shall, shall we, we get begin? started? Oh, but first, just relax, all right? I'm only here to listen to whatever you wish to talk about. Yes. Sure. Although the, I only, I really only have one thing on my mind right now, anyway. Hmm. Yes, I'd say that makes perfect sense. But don't force yourself into talking with me. You could even just grab some snacks if and be on your way if you wanted. <laughs> No, it's, it's alright. I, I know I need to talk to somebody about this anyway. That is, if you're willing to listen to the super long story. I absolutely am. Take all the time you need. I think it should be longer. It should be longer. The whole game should be long. <laughs> I see. That's such a horrible thing to do to someone. Yes, that's why I wanted to get even with him. For Shiho. Mm-hmm. And? At first, I thought Kamishida ought to face the same fate Shiho was going through, uh, going to put herself through, but, but, later, I realized that wasn't right. If she did take his, if he did take his own life, it wouldn't undo Shiho's suffering. In fact, it'd just give him the easy way out. Right. Is that so? You know, you are the, quite the wise, level-headed young woman, Takamiki-san. Huh? Uh, I think you've got the wrong... Nope. In fact, I think you're wiser than I was at your age. I wasn't anywhere near as mature as you are now. It's not like I did anything special, though. If I hadn't gone through my own share of hell, I don't think I'd be so mature either. I see. So what's on your mind now? Hmm, right now? Think. Hmm. I'm just hoping Shiho will get b better quickly. We both suffered a lot, but I just want to have... I just want to get back to laughing and having fun together like we used to. At this point, I don't give a rat's ass about Kamashita. Yeah. Now there's a healthy lookout. You can't change the past, but you still want to keep your chin up and press onwards. Is that the gist of it? Yeah, that sounds about right. I mean, it'd definitely be better if none of this had happened at all, but... Quite. <laughs> I definitely agree with you there. But it's impossible to wipe every tragedy from history. Yeah. If only, right? Oh, fuck. Everyone would be so much happier if we could actually do that. <clears throat> oh, it seems I lost track of time. We should wrap things up here uh, up here for today. Thank you for com so much for coming to see me. Oh, no, thank you. I feel a, ton, a, lot, a ton better now that it, that's all off my chest. Be careful. Okay? Huh, good to hear it. You deserve it. Feel free to stop by again anytime. Okay, Will I'm do. Gonna get see going. you around. Maruki moments. Well, I went in for counseling. You're going soon too, right? 
How'd it go? Well, it wasn't as rough as I was expecting. I think you should just go and give it a shot. Dr. Maraki's easier to talk to than you'd think. He is a bro. What? No, I didn't want to be taken there. Never mind. I wanted to be taken there. How are you? Hello, Yoshizawa. Are you here for a session as well? Yes. That's right. Is that so? Dr. Maraki's a wonderful counselor. I've actually been seeing him for a while before he ever came to Shujin. That's suspicious. Uh? Oh, I didn't know you two were acquainted. Don't go overselling me too hard though, Yoshizawa-san. I'm really nothing special. <laughs> well, I need to get going. Please excuse me. Sus? The two new right. characters introduced to Royal? Why is Yoshizawa preface with a student called? Because you don't know her first name yet. Welcome. Welcome, thank you for coming. Well, you haven't been formally introduced. You kind of just have brushed past each other thousands, like thousands of times and haven't properly been introduced. Uh, <laughs> we made a deal. Marky, you, me, and you. <laughs> I'll try and make sure it's worth the trouble. Let's see. Hmm, thank you. I, I think I've gotten a good grasp of the situation you're in. Well, full disclosure, the school gave me a brief rundown of the circumstances surrounding your transfer here. It's in the past. Did you have to force yourself to accept everything that happened? No, that doesn't seem to be it. So... Now that you've told me more about yourself, I think I've realized something. It seems you've largely been able to reconcile your inner, internal world with your external one. I should note, that's really, truly impressive. Even most adults can't reliably manage that. How to, how to put it? You know how everyone has an internal reality? Some conception of themselves they're striving for? for like wanting to be a model student, or wanting to be loved and relied on. That kind of thing. But that idealized reality, and the one in actuality, are often far apart. That gap is responsible for a lot of people's pain. Not everyone can ace their exams, and not everyone can be the heroes they wish they could be. You've already been through so much. That kind of suffering is usually enough to twist people up into dark places. But you, you're standing up to it, and confronting a tough, painful reality. To me, that's incredibly admirable. Then again, maybe that's a little weird for, for you to hear from a guy you've just met, huh? But it sounds right. <laughs> Not even deflecting self-deprecation. You really are strong. I'm sorry. Well, let's see. Sorry, this went on longer than I expected. Somehow this conversation just took on a life of its own, I guess. Sad sigh. Say, hey, I've actually got one last request. Do you mind? You know, I'm actually I... doing certain research along with my duties as a counselor. It's not quite like counseling, more like a type of psychological treatment. Basically, it's a product it's a project to learn more about people's metaphorical hearts. What they think, how they feel. How about it? If I get far enough with it, I think it'll be able to help a lot of people. So? I'll need more details. Uh, oh, sorry. Oh, he said it for me. I guess my point is, I'd like to ask to help you to help with that research. All you'd have to do is listen to my theories and then tell me if they spark any ideas or realizations on your end. Please, any time's good for me. I can work around your schedule. And uh, I've got a lot of snacks too. You can have them. They're yours. Well, okay. Really? Yes, you're a lifesaver. Well, let's see. I know, maybe I could teach you some tips for mental training. I happen to know a lot about the subject. I'm sure I can cook up a special regimen for you. If you're dedicated enough, I'm sure I, you could draw, draw out your full potential. Thank you. Okay, I guess that's our second deal. Let's go, Mariki. Bros, we've we've achieved Detox X. When Joker is afflicted with an ailment, he may recover immediately. All right. He's got good shit. I know. All right. Would it be okay if we traded contact information? I'll contact you when I've got some time or when I need some input from you. Let's go, Maruki. That should do it. Now. Now I'd better do my part and rep to repay you. Let's talk about mental training and presence. Let's see. First off. Therapist. Right. My max SP increased by five. Oh, and here, never a bad time for a snack, right? We got non-static gum. Well, 
See you. Thank you for your help today. I'll see you around at school. He's the best best character in the game. Hands down. Man. You really spent a long time talking to Mariki. Look how late it is. Well, if you think the sessions are worthwhile, you should try going again Tonight. sometime. But well, we should definitely get some sleep for now. Tomorrow's your last day of exams, right? Oh nice. shit, yeah. You, you're going to give me exam help, bro. What was that all about? Go to bed. I don't want to go to bed. Hey. Let's not do that today. Bro. I guess I have to go to bed. Bedtime. And then we continue with exam. Maraki just carries this game. Ryuji? <laughs> so sleepy. What did you do? I ended up pulling an all-nighter once I realized today is the last day of exams. Fool. Hey, staying up studying? Nah, I gave up on the exam. <laughs> Playing some games, and then before I knew it, it was morning. Fool. You're failing for sure. Yeah, it'll be fine. Nobody's expecting anything of me, so I don't gotta worry about grades. You do. Uh, morning. Yo, look who else is yawning. All night up? Exams are almost over, so I thought I'd make one last effort across the finish line. These guys are idiots? <gasps> Impressive, Lady On. You're quite different from this stupid monkey I know. Yo, calm down. Huh? Don't give me that crap. Your brain's tiny compared to mine. Got him. Size is meaningless if there's nothing inside, you know. Got him times two. What was that? <laughs> <sighs> Will you please shut up? You're gonna make me forget everything I remember. Huh? <laughs> Am I imagining things? Probably. What's wrong? What? You see a groper or something? No, that's not it. Are you being it's stalked? Nothing. Hmm? Morgana sees it too. So does Ryuji. They all know. Here he comes. Oh my god, that guy got off. Isn't this bad? We're being stalked. Hey, at least act like you care. Calm down. Fine. He's tired. Come on. Huh? Oh. Keys. <laughs> Bitch. Oh. Anime. Hello, Yusuke. Uh, hmm. Hmm. Hey, uh, are you sure it's him, or are you just that self-conscious? <laughs> Is there something you want? Hello, Matt Mercer. <laughs> That's my line! You are the one stalking me! Stalking you? That's outrageous. I know you've been following me ever since the train! That's because... Huh? Art boy, art boy. My goodness. I had wondered why you left the car. So this is where your passion led. All is well that ends well. Art boy is here. <laughs> Hello, Madurame. I saw you from the car, and I couldn't help myself from chasing after you. So you got on the fucking the train? Sensei, but thank goodness I caught up to you. Okay. What? You're the woman I've been searching for all this time. Please, won't you? Wait a minute, I... Be the model for my next art piece. M model? Yeah, she does modeling. All that I've drawn till now has been lacking. Hard boy needs to hurry up in character development right now. <laughs> like anyone else. <laughs> this man's highly suspicious. He is a very suspicious Isn't individual, so but, you know, that's just how Yusuke is. Will you cooperate with me? What do you say? Model for him. <laughs> Hold your horses. Who are you anyways? Oh, where are my manners? I'm a second year at Kosei High's Fine Arts Division. 
My name is Yusuke Kitagawa. Hello, Yusuke. Get out of the way, Ryuji. Pupil, and I am being allowed residence at his place. I'm striving to become an artist. Art boy. <laughs> Do you mean that, Madarame? The one who was on Good Morning Japan? The Big man, Madarame. The very same. You know who that is? Big famous man. He was introduced as a super famous Japanese style artist who's been recognized all over the world. Uh, but we heard that name the other day in Mementos. And if you were here for it, Sai was like, Yusuke. Yo, this guy, Madarame, Sorry, what did you do to this guy? That old guy's Madarame? Madarame Sensei's exhibition will begin at the department store near the station tomorrow. I'll be there to help out on opening day. Please come by. It'd be great if you could give me your answer in regard to being a model then. I bet you have no interest in the fine arts, but I'll give you tickets too. <laughs> Looks at Ryuji dead in the eyes as he said that. Not even me. Okay. I hope to see you there tomorrow. I will. Thank you, Yusuke. Thank you for being so nice. That guy's as easy to read as a book. That's probably a good thing. You're not thing. planning on going, are ya? I think I will. Yeah, it's a fucking art show. You got free tickets! Crap, look at the time. I'll see you later. Oh yeah, the final day of exams. How dare he go after Lady On? I've memorized that face of yours, Yusuke. Oh god, we're going forwards in time again! What did they put in my breakfast this morning? What did you put on those tickets, Yusuke? You became acquainted with Madarame's pupil by chance. Free tickets, bro. That's exactly. Too convenient. It makes me wonder if you're even telling the truth. So be it. It lines up what with I your testimonies. Your so you have to believe. It's true me. that Madarame was an unforgivable criminal worthy of the scorn thrown at him. Jeez. He was an adult who cultivated his own fame and fortune by sacrificing the livelihood of children. But he'd been covering his tracks. It's not for a confidant. This is story. How did you uncover the truth in such a short span of time? Let me tell you a little bit about myself. In the metaverse. This metaverse business again? Yusuke left some. Uh, <laughs> Yusuke like. Let's suppose that <laughs> I whiff some pain. By stealing their treasure, like you've said. If so, a different suspicion arises. What? People have gone mad or lost consciousness, never to recover, like the subway accident in April. Oh, but you Depending see, I had nothing to do with that. It, that could be taken as a phenomenon for a sudden change of heart, too. You're correct. Are you related to those as well? No. I, I don't want to say. Those are not mm, good answers. I see. <laughs> Fine. Just Let's say no. Let's get back no. to case. Keep it concise and stick to the facts. Okay, so basically, this guy wanted to... Like, he asked Arn, who was my classmate, who sits in front of me... Mm. <laughs> To model for him. She's like a model. She's like a famous model. <laughs> no, I'm not getting a great score because my knowledge was rank one. I have. I need like one more point to get to rank two. This is so sad. I basically aced all of my other exams. <laughs> this is so sad. But exams are over. Mood. It's over. Mood as fuck. How about you? It's over. Come on, you two need to get your act together. What? Anyways, can we stop talking about the exam? I was just saying it's I over. Cannot. They're gonna come back graded next week. There he is, Madarame, so behind Ryuji. What are you looking at? The usual site. It's no use. There ain't any useful info. The number of posts are getting less and less too. Let's go talk to Yusuke. I'm not letting this end as a one-hit wonder, okay? We need to go find out There's if Madarame is empty, a bitch. Though. I know. Why don't we go eat lunch somewhere? We still have some money left over from the other day. Let's go. I want sushi then, or domestic raised eel. Do we have that much money? We don't have that much left. Actually, I have like 100,000 oh, right. yen. There are those tickets to Madarame's exhibit. Uh, like. Wait, that's tomorrow. Yeah. What the hell's going on? Was it love at first sight with that Yusuke guy? We got free tickets, no, dumbass! Oh, of course not. When I was watching that special on TV, his artwork was pretty nice. Plus, we've got free tickets. Besides, we got free this tickets. To what we heard in Mementos. Madarame, was it? Uh, I'm curious too. 
Hmm. Hmm. That aside, what should I do about the other two tickets? Take me with you. Appreciate some fine arts for once? I want to go appreciate Yusuke. Fine arts, huh? I suggest we should all go together. Appreciating the fine arts builds character. A phantom thief who can't identify an original is lame. <clears throat> well, if everyone's going, it's settled then. Uh, it should be fun. It's art. Just the phrase going to an art exhibit sounds kind of mature. Just like what Maraki said about you. Let's meet at the exhibit <laughs> entrance tomorrow. <laughs> Let me see Maraki again, please. Okay. We can't afford to go out. This is bullshit. Uh, yeah, that sounds about right. Madorami's about to fucking get his get slapped. Nice. Man, I want to give my plants some equip. I want to give. Oh, I can. I can. I can. Okay. I, can I can make three. I'm gonna make three lock picks. Yeah. Let's go. Woo! Mm -hmm. Let's go. An extra lock pick. Yes. Yeah. Give me that proficiency up. Give me that proficiency build. Nice. That extra point. And now we go to bed. Even though I'm probably never going to use all of these lockpicks. I I remember my first playthrough of Royal. I just did I just didn't end up using all of my lockpicks. I made like almost 60, and there's only like there's not 60 in the entire game. <laughs> I don't think. Especially locked chests. But lockpicks are so easy to make. So crowded. Yeah, it's an odd ex exhibit. It'll be a pain in the ass if someone sees you, so don't stick your head out too much, all right? He's sticking his entire body out. You came. He's here. Um, yeah. Of course we came. It's free tickets. You really came. What you expect when you left us those tickets? Yeah. Make sure that you don't get in the way of the other visitors. Don't worry. Come now. I'll show you around. What? I'd like to speak more about the picture I'd like to Don't you think? To. Rip. Well, see you guys later. Will Lady Hun be all right? What if he drags her behind some painting and tries something funny? I told you not to come out. <sighs> Are we really gonna appreciate the fine arts? Can't we just go home? Why did you come then? But we're gonna learn about Madara. We should do a quick pass through at once. Uh. Which way are we supposed to start? Let's just go follow them. Never mind. Hmm? There he is. That old man from the other day. There he is. We continue to be truly surprised by your imagination. You have such expansive styles. I'm still staying with you. Nah, they went off person. by themselves. Where in the world does all your inspiration come from? That's a good question, Madarami. It is rather difficult to put into words. <laughs> Ryuji just fucking walks up well in, up like, in the background of, like, a news broadcast. One after another in the spring. Naturally, you say. Naturally. What's important is to distance oneself from worldly desires, such as money and fame. My atelier is a modest shack, but it is more than enough to pursue true beauty. A shack? I see. So the act of emptying one's Bro, well, mind gives stick rise together. to inner beauty. Because if you split Still, up, you get more information that way. We could hear the word shack coming from the great artist Madarame. I mean, think about it. There's a guy called I Shack. If you saw it. <laughs> Wasn't the word shack something? Madarame what are you talking is about? Here? Yeah, oh, it's there. his exhibit. I'm so glad I came on opening day. Oh no. <laughs> hey, stop pushing. Too many people. We've been stampeded. I'm getting crushed. Every man for himself. We gotta head for the exit. Don't die on us, all right? Bye, Morgana. I didn't know there were so many types of Japanese art. Usually, one concentrates on their own style. However, since he creates all this by himself, press X to doubt. Special. There you are, Yusuke. Yo, what up? Him? Sensei. Ah, the girl from yesterday. Are you enjoying the exhibit? I don't know how to put it into words, but it's really amazing. You're sensing something from the artwork. That alone is enough to give us artists satisfaction. 
I hope this becomes a wonderful piece, Yusuke. Well then, if you'll excuse me. Goodbye. You'd imagine artists would be difficult to approach. This seems really Press friendly. X to doubt. It's funny because X is the text progression. X is default. Oh, default A button. Painting I wanted to see in person. This painting? This one? Yeah. I guess it's the painter's anger. I'm not sure, but I sense this strong frustration from it. I mean, the sky's think red. Such a cheerful and gentlemanly person could make such a piece. <laughs> People can do things. Something wrong? Don't mind me. There are better pieces than this one. No. Oh, no. This way. Hey. That doesn't sound very uh cash money. Ah, that old lady totally elbowed me. Thanks to that. Nice. I remember now. Uh, about what? Well, let me get to it. It's about a post online. Here, look at this. What a small phone. Why'd you leave without me? We got stampeded out. You got it all wrong. We got dragged into this. I wonder why this painter was so frustrated. Eh, anyways, you got. Bro, I wasn't finished trip. reading. This post might be about Madarame. You need a bigger phone, Ryuji. What's it say? I can't read that. A master of the Japanese arts is plagiarizing his pupils. You say to read it and then you read it yourself. Nice. Shown on TV. Plagiarizing? Plagiarizing. I didn't think much of it when I first saw it, but hearing Shaq and Madarame triggered it. The collab of the century. His treatment of the pupils who live with him is awful. He teaches nothing and bosses them around. He treats them inhumanely as if disciplining a dog. Oh. Abuse on top of plagiarism, huh? Oh no. If this is real, it'll be a huge scandal. I wonder if Kitagawa kun posted this. Probably not. I mean, he is a pupil of his. Who knows? It's anonymous and all. In that case, he didn't it's seem that. The Madarame we heard about in Mementos. I don't know. He's the same one. A man like that doing such a thing? I wonder if we can ask he's gonna like fucking he's this. gonna be like yo what up it's me Madarame what are you you talking about me what up are we gonna go about that are we gonna explain it all starting with mementos we just ask Yusuke if we make a move out in the open there's the possibility that Madarame will find out oh yeah right hey what do you think about Madarame doesn't he seem suspicious he's an old man but he does seem suspicious. I know, He's too nice. This all fits way too well to just be a coincidence. If this and it, and legit, like, of course we know. We know he's a bad guy. For? Well, yeah, but is it really true? By the way, what did you do about the whole modeling thing? Did you agree? Kitago Akun gave me his contact info. Let's go. To his sensei's atelier. He said we he got the shack. Right? Perfect timing. Let's try going tomorrow. We're off to Madarame's house right after school. I don't want to go to Shaq. Huh? You want me to model tomorrow? This is too sudden. What? We're just going to go talk to Kitagawa. We've been new. Oh, that's what you meant. Yes. Okay. Well then. The home shopping town. Nice. Kind of use. Can I leave? Oh! I am allowed to leave, but I can't really do anything. So I'm gonna read a book instead. Hey! Wait, wait, hold on. There are no crosswords. This is so sad. So yeah, I'm gonna read. Hey! Uh, which one do I do? Sorry, because I'm at school tomorrow. Wait a minute. <laughs> yep. <laughs> Pay attention to how cool Zoro is. Yes, your persona is pretty cool, Morgana. Hey, hey! Zoro is not only strong in mind and body, but he also cared greatly for the common people. It seems you really understand the qualities that made Zoro so great. <laughs> Our kindness is <sighs> up. Let's go to sleep. At what time is evening in Persona? Hmm. 
Maruki? Hey, let's get started. Hey there, I'm Dr. Maruki, your school counselor. Thanks to the school, I can even talk to you outside of counseling now. I want to talk a little about how mental health and perception can affect you. Don't worry, I don't want to stress you out or anything, just relax and listen. How much do you guys know about the emotional mind? So, see, what's going in your body in what's going on in your body can affect your body in your mind can affect your body pretty significantly. There's proof it can even heal you depending on your outlook. So, you there. Any ideas? What do we call the phenomenon where believing in a treatment's power is enough to improve your condition? That's the placebo effect. This is it. That's right. Yep, that's correct. Some people specify that placebos don't actually have any curative properties, but even if the medicine does nothing chemically, it can affect your perception and help you feel better. On the other hand, if you don't trust the medicine to begin with, it might make you feel even worse. We call that a nocebo. No way. No way. Yeah, I'm a smart genius. Also, who hasn't heard of the placebo effect? I am learned! Alright. I am no longer oblivious. That's just one example, but my point is that our minds and bodies are more connected than we think. So it's important to not to push yourself too hard. Remember, your mind needs time to rest too. And it's my job to help with that, so come to the nurse's office whenever you're feeling down. Do you think I'll change it back into a human if I just believe in it hard enough? Believe in yourself, Morgana, you'll go, you'll go places. We got a lot of Madarame shit. We're on the train. Ten thieves going by train. <laughs> this ain't any different from how I get home from school, you know. The train is the fastest way to go. Oh, what's happening? Plus, we can bring pets on here. Hey, who are you calling a pet? Dude, be quiet. We didn't pay the pet fare. I'm the one guiding you to your destination. Morgana, You're this is not the time. Master. You fool. Shoot. Is that your pet, mister? I heard it meowing. Yeah, it's my... It's... It's, uh... It, uh, 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 it's a stuffed animal. Yeah, it's just a toy. It meows when you press on its head. You heard her. Press on its head. This is ridiculous. <laughs> well, <laughs> I should press gently. Time to press forcefully. Time to button mash! This is what you get for getting sticking your fucking head out of the- wait. This is what you get for st fuck it. oh damn. That's what you get for sticking your head out of the bag when you weren't supposed to, Morgana. You get what you fucking deserve. The next stop is Shibuya. Shibuya. Doors will open on the left side. Oh, this is our stop. Well, see you later. Bye-bye. Mm-hmm. Bye-bye. So, which line do we got to transfer to? Doesn't look like there are any stations close by to that address. Let's if walk. Anything, this is the closest station. What? And we gotta walk the rest of the way? Walking is good for yourself. Takes the train and then walks to their destination. Someone without a car. You're complaining. It's supposedly a shack, but this is the neighborhood he lives in. As expected of a famous artist. Looks like the fastest route is to get to the station square and then go to Central Street. Let's move. Central Street, eh? Well, I guess I'll go to the Central Square. What? It's so dark outside. This is crazy nuts. Wait. Um. Him? Suguru Kamashita, former Olympian, teacher at Shujin Academy. Reason for turning himself in is uh, a heavy conscience, huh? The yeah. human mind doesn't change that easily. Let alone their natural temperament. You sure about that? <sighs> Shujin Academy. Seems doubtful. Nice PNG. Perhaps I'll have someone look into it. 
Just in case. Evil man does evil thing evilly. Is that it? We're at the right address. Yeah, that's a shack. Our plate does say Matarame. Uh, you ring the bell. Me? Can I take a nap before among us? See you, When I do, will they? No one sneeze or we'll blow this house down, okay? Haha, <laughs> funny. Who is it? Sensei. Yo, what up? Um, it's Takamaki. And? I'll be right out. You fool. People really do live here. Takamaki, sir. You two are here as well? What's wrong with that? Hey, sorry, but uh, we ain't here to talk about the modeling thing. There's something we gotta ask you. Is it true Matarame's plagiarizing stuff? Bro. He's abusing people too, yeah? Bro, you don't just go are right off serious? the bat. We're not even inside. We read about it online. So? This? <laughs> okay, man. Preposterous! Not only is the plagiarism impossible, but abuse? He welcomes pupils into his own home. This is no act of violence. It is charity. And I'm the one residing here and studying under him. I'm saying it's not true. So it's beyond doubt. Okay. If you, you say so. You might be lying about it. That... Ryuji? That is utter oh. rubbish. Never mind, Ryuji. Keep going. I had no family when Sensei took me in and raised me into what you see now. If you continue to ridicule the man I owe my life to, you will rue this day. No need to be so defensive really about that? it, though. Yusuke. He's here. What's the matter? I heard you yelling. These people are slandering you with baseless rumors. No, hold on. Forgive them, Yusuke. Well, they must have heard some bad rumors and came in worry for their friend's safety. We just wanted to <sighs> ask about them. Sensei. You didn't have to be so pissy well, about it. I doubt it. that a cranky old man like myself could be liked by everyone. That's not what we meant. I'm sorry to have butt in on your conversation. However, I do have neighbors around. Won't you please keep it down? Now, if you'll excuse me. <clears throat> that was discourteous of me. I'm sorry. A apologize, Ryuji? I now? I think you'll be able to believe in Sensei if you saw that painting. It's his maiden work, as well as his most representative piece. It's titled Sayuri. Sayuri? This was the painting that inspired me to become an artist. It's so beautiful. I don't know all this fine art stuff, but even I can tell that this is impressive. When I first saw you, I felt the same powerful emotion as when I saw this painting. Me? I wish to pursue beauty like this. And okay. I believe drawing you will be part of that pursuit. I implore you, seriously consider my offer. I'm sorry okay. that you took the time to come all this way, but I mean we I just we just wanted to today. talk. I dude. hope that we can discuss this further another time. If you'll excuse me then. Will you be nice to me as well? Those two seem like nice guys, don't they? Yusuke does. Maybe the Matarame we heard about in Memento If you weren't pissing him off, Ryuji. Man, right when we thought we found a new target, too. How's the MetaNav? Uh, you should probably check that first. Hey, the app. Was it picking up our conversation? This display. It means that Matarame has a palace, too, right? Wow, he's good at hiding but things. Why? Matarame, plagiarism, and then Shaq, huh? These seem to be the keywords. For real, though, what For the real. hell is going on? Does an old man like him really have a palace? I mean, we even if you're old, in the, the metaverse, All that's you're fucking powerful. What that Madarame mistakes the shack for to enter his palace. Does he really mistake his you shack for that? Like how Kamoshida thought the is it really his mistake castle? the word you're looking that's for? Right. Let's try saying some things. They can be random guesses. Ah, uh, yes. Though. The method at which the Phantom the Thieves castle? just no guess then the location. What about prison? Dude, I love prison. Ah, what a pain. 
Jail. A warehouse. Jail. And guidance counseling office. Guidance well, counseling well, office. No Not a single hit. Yeah, you. Should we come back another time? No, I haven't Building given it a try yet. Related to artists. If we think from there, oh, what's a building that's related to artists? Ryuji doesn't un understand that old people can be shitty. Ryuji doesn't understand that people can lie about their feelings. But yeah, a building that's related to artists. Oh, I wonder what out of the three here yeah, is like. What relates to artists? Whoa, really? What would he mistake this shitty old shack for? Somewhere where he stores his paintings. Oh, I know. A fucking museum. Hey, when did you activate the nav? You surprised me. And? Didn't have much of a choice. I think we just happened to get it right. What if I hadn't noticed and then wandered off and got caught by an enemy? Why would you wander off? We're in the middle of a conversation. Walking on two legs. <laughs> <laughs> so even you can slip into the metaverse. People can't lie. Realizing what do you mean? Madonna? Yes. In a place with minimal cognitive distortion, the differences can be subtle. Yeah. Forget that. Look. You you say minimal cognitive distortions. That doesn't yeah, seem like seriously some kind of museum. That doesn't seem minimal. Let's go check it out. Big gold. Big gold. It's so extravagant. To the point that it's gaudy. Mm. It's a museum, right? I think so. This is Matarame's? Well, a palace is a world formed by a mind twisted by desire. Remember Kamoshida's castle? Matarame's artwork is on display at museums in reality too, though. I mean, look at all the people, popular, though. And people already respect him. Why would he fantasize about a museum? It's made out of gold now. You got a point. Yeah. It ain't related to plagiarism or abuse either. Let's try looking around. Racking our brains here won't do us any good. Mm, I'm vibing to the right. music. That aside, ain't a museum a must for Phantom Thieves? That's why I was second in game design. Uh, there are probably traps too. Yeah, all those old man's fans were super strong and all. Oh that yeah. Has nothing to do with this. <laughs> but man, just look at that insane crowd. Yeah, it's very long. Oh yeah, I changed my outfit. Oh yeah, it's time to change my outfit. Because it's the first time in the metaverse. For this, I don't know, part? Is this a part now? Parts? Anyway, what should I change my outfit to? We did uh, the new cinema outfit, we've done Starlight, and we've done Gekakon High. What do I want to do now? I could do, uh... Hmm. What would I want to do? I could do Yasugami. Dance! But I did. That was the starlight. The other dance one's kind of crap. It's not as good. Dance where is actually fucking shit. Starlight is much better. But guess we gotta go for the the dance. Look at how shit this is. What, Milgana is just a fucking bowl of cotton candy. I actually despise this costume so much. We write something. We're gonna save. If you're gonna be, do we have to be behind right now? I would recommend you uh, refresh, so you're no longer behind. Anyway, we uh, we just we go vibe. Yep. This is really how he thinks of that run-down shack. It's overwhelmingly shiny. It's just not hitting me that this is that old guy's palace. This is why that's why we're here, right? Come on, let's go check it out. Yeah, it's actually Yusuke's palace. Focus. Ooh. Item. I 
thought my headset was on backwards. It was not. Item. All the dance outfits are just like casual. Yeah, it's fucking cringe. Wow. A lone fucking platform. I don't know why there's a lone platform there. But extra, not as cool. I yeah, exactly. That's why I like my dance wear, but I've already done dance wear. Uh, not dance wear. Star, starlight. Uh, yes, my starlight outfits, because they actually feel, they, they look better. Watch the VODs, I'll see the starlight one. I'm putting them on now, just for one. And then I think I'm going to do a ultramarine outfit, so it's going to be right there. These actually have like a sort of, because these, these are the one featured in Persona 5 Dancing. So they just, they just, that fits better. Look at that. It looks so much better. Hey. Oh, the skylight's open. I think we can get in here. But it's a pretty far drop. Will we be able to get back out this way? Now's my time Don't worry, I have a rope. I am our tool specialist, after all. Where did you get that rope from? So what's it called, Joker? Wanna head inside? Oh, these do fit so much better. Yeah, the dance, oh, honestly, the original Persona 5 had the, that dancewear option. And I hated it, and then they came out with Persona 5 dancing, and I was like, perfect. Oh. Hey, this? It's a it's a guy. Come on, we're in a palace. That ain't anything f to be freaking out over. The this palace is... reflects its ruler's heart. We may want to check these paintings out. Person? Hmm? Oh, hey, there's some kind of explanation here. Let me see. It's someone's name and age? What the hell? That can't be the title of the painting, right? Do you think it's the artist's name? Hmm. Let's check the other paintings too. I think there might be something important about them. I have something. Uh, yeah. It looks pretty, uh... Hey, hey. Oh, okay. We're going into the next room then. We run. We roam. We roaming. We roam. We roaming? Look at all of these amazing things of art. It's the students. Whoa, whoa, whoa. Like, I would have assumed that right off the bat, to be honest. Like... Hey, this doesn't make any sense. Madarame's famous for having a variety of art styles. Yeah, these all, all look the, the same. on display here look the same. This is way different from what was at the... Wait a sec. You guys aren't even looking. <laughs> that guy we saw in Mementos? I mean, I am assuming that right the off the bat. Shit yeah, it's pretty Can obvious. His name's written on the plaque. Him. Dude, I don't get it. Why is there a painting of him in here? He was a student of Madarame. Why is his name written under it? You're right. Doesn't art usually have like? It is the title of the piece, piece dumbass. The artist's name? Hmm, this is quite the mystery. He considers them right. his work of art. Keep looking around for I don't actually know why Madarami was bad aside from that painting Yusuke liked. Well, you get to find out in this playthrough of Persona 5 Royale. <gasps> Who's that? <laughs> hey, isn't this a painting of that guy? Yusuke? It says Yusuke Kitagawa. There's no mistaking it. And I recommend you catch up on the VODs. Wait a second. What do you think these paintings are? There's f fucking pupils. I think you're right. It's a good photo. It's a good photo as well. But it was only Yusuke when we went to his place before. Yeah, what do you think? What do you think that means, Ryuji? Include former pupils as well. Only one remains now. Taking into account what that Nakanohara guy said earlier, things are getting clearer. All right, let's keep investigating. We need something to further confirm our deductions. Hmm. I wonder what's over here then. <gasps> what's that noise? Not that noise. Hmm? Wait, you find something? Yeah, it looks like a map. So we're gonna go open a treasure. Straw doll. We're gonna come over here. Get this locked treasure chest. Because we got 14 lockpicks. We got a lunar cut. Which oh. is better than the one we have yep. now. Hmm. It's a pamphlet. This is getting way too detailed for a freaking palace. Why'd he bother making something? Because it's his oh, cognition. Yeah. 
Every museum has a map. Nice. That could be a possibility. At the very least, it should be good reference for the scale of this place. It's a big fucking place. One out of two. <sighs> Time to go find the second out of two. We're not going to do all of the palace today because we kind of get kicked out anyway. Whoa. Uh, What's this? Look at this. It's big. The Infinite Spring? A conglomerate work of art that the great director Madarame created with his own funds. These individuals must offer their ideas to the director for the rest of their lives. Those who cannot do so have no worth living? That sounds like an Infinite Spring. Hey. This is most likely about the plagiarism, right? Yeah, I'd say so. Damn it. What a phony geezer. In other words, his pupils are his property. His the uh, his qualifies an art. Artist, this is true. He's stealing the ideas from talented students in exchange for securing their livelihood. We got to show Yusuke I this. About those portraits Wait. On display. They must all be his pupils through his cognition. This even says that they have no worth. Are you Could calling? Uh, did, you, did you just say art has no worth? Keep them around as long as they're useful to him. But the moment they're Organa not. hates artists. Confirmed. He's treating them like slaves or tools. Why is Yusuke keeping quiet about this? He's got no reason to cover this up. What if he doesn't know? He did say that he owes Madarame his life for being taken in. But still. When we were at the exhibit, I praised one of the pieces on display, but. He knows. Takaba-kun acted strange. Maybe that piece was plagiarized too. What's the call? Ain't this enough to target Madarame? Uh, what do you all think? It's unanimous after all. We should confirm these facts with Yusuke first. Yeah. Confirm what though? It means we should get solid evidence that such crimes actually took place. This is pretty solid, not gonna lie. Pain in the ass. Besides, there's too much we don't know about Madarame. We don't even- wait, actually we do know that this is his You're palace. Right. I'll try contacting Kitagawa-kun. Not I here, hopefully. I might be able to get the truth out of him if I accept his modeling offer. Wait, you're gonna do that? I mean, it's modeling. You all better come with me, okay? I'm scared to go What alone. could possibly happen? Famous, renowned artist, huh? Oh, this might be tougher than Kamoshida. I hope not. We'll just prep ourselves until we get confirmation from Yusuke. This is our first mission as real phantom thieves. We're gonna succeed no matter what. These first two palaces are gonna be really painful, specifically without Ryuji's insta kill ability. <sighs> but you know, what can you do? Mm. We're just building up plot. Would you really forgive someone unconditionally if you owe your life to them? I'm not so sure anymore. What are you bringing this up for? According to Kitagawa-kun, Madarame isn't a problem. What do you mean? Something wrong? I mean, I know Madarame is a bad person, but still, maybe I'm so hesitant because I haven't actually met any of his victims. Yeah, I guess that part's totally different from what happened with Kamoshida. This might be an extreme line of thinking, but an if, if an evil person isn't causing any trouble now, is there really a point in us stepping in? Well, you got a point. So we're gonna let Yusuke decide if Madarame is worth off going after or not? I don't know. If it were me, I'd never forgive that bastard. Let's see how Yusuke feels. Yeah, I could. I guess we could talk some more after that. Okay, let's meet in Shibuya after school tomorrow. What if we talk to that Naka. Well, the, that other guy who we, we beat up before? What? I'm, I'm exhausted? I guess we have to go to bed. Hello? Person? Hey, it's me. Ryuji? I just can't forgive Madarame, but what On said made me think. To Yusuke, are we just a bunch of thugs? Some pretty epic thugs. But, yeah, but uh, I mean, to him, you were pretty thuggish. <sighs> I knew it. It ain't like he thinks it is. Pisses me off just thinking about it. And this is why he thinks you're a thug. So much crap while, while shitty adults do whatever they want. Makes me sick. I'm not wrong, am I? You're not wrong at all. You're right. But Thanks. you need to calm down. Tell on I called you, by the way. Uh, seriously. Well, see you tomorrow. <laughs> Morgana looks up at me. 
I'm gonna taunt him about this later. <laughs> How has it only been like an hour and a half? It really doesn't feel like it's been an hour and a half. Alright, I, con I contacted Kitago Akuna about modeling for him. I'm still waiting his response. Thanks. I really have no idea what I'm supposed to do as an art model, though. Just be yourself? That's actually kind of hard. Look, you don't gotta go all out for this. You're only doing it so you can get dirt on Madarame, remember? That is true. It sounded like Kitago Akuna wants this to be a private picture of his, though. Well, I guess I'll let you guys know when he contacts me again. Did you tell him that we're gonna be coming? I hope you did. I don't want to just show up. I got a response from Kitago Akun. He said he wants me to come over after school today. Perfect. Probably dropped all his plans just to get you over there. We need to find out from Kitago Akun if what we saw in the palace was true. But did you tell him? Hey, quiet down. It's that student council president. Makoto, let's go. Talking to Mishima. Yikes. She got all the Mishima today? It'd suck if she noticed us. Come on, I'll split up. I'm gonna go talk okay. to her. <laughs> See you later. <laughs> Goodbye. We finally landed a big target. Come on, let's get some dirt on Matarame. But man, Han's late. Sorry. What did you expect? I was thinking about some things and didn't notice how much time had passed. Thinking about what? Don't you think Kitago Akun has to be protecting Matarame? I mean, they yeah. live together, so he'd have to be aware of Matarame's true nature. The only reason I can think of him doing that is that Matarame has something on it. You have no idea. Yeah, that's weird. But that's why we're going to check it out, right? You ready to be a model? Literally, you have no idea what's yeah, going on. Yeah, I'm prepared. What do you mean prepared? Prepared for what? That made it sound really ominous. You have no Something idea what he's doing you. to him. <laughs> Uh, not, not at all. She's actually just kind of normal. Oh, no. I feel like she's got more makeup on or something. How am I supposed to tell from that? I'm the same as always. Huh. Well, let's get going. You really look at Ron's face that much, Ryuji? To Kitago notice? Kitago Akun seemed really happy when I agreed to be his model. You did Once tell him that we were here, though. It's a little friendlier. We should bring up Madarame. Once he finishes drawing, you know how long that's going to take? I thought it would just be you coming, Takamaki. You didn't tell him. Wouldn't you get nervous too if it was just the two of us? We're here to keep an eye on you, so uh, don't try anything perverted, okay? Stop making such odd assumptions. I have absolutely no interest in her as someone of the opposite sex. This is a pog champ moment. Huh? Is there a problem? No, not really. <laughs> Well then, let's get started. The vibe. Hey. Hey. Kitago Akun? Hmm. He's focused. You hear her? Hmm. No. It's no use. He's enthralled. This isn't what we planned. We were gonna catch him off guard and make him spill his beans, weren't we? He doesn't care. How were we supposed to know this was gonna happen? He's a big vibe. Guess we just gotta wait till he's done. What a effing pain in the ass. Perhaps I should try the bag just jumps. This room. Uh, don't get caught. Hm. Who do you think you're talking to? I'm talking to a cat. This is too boring. So I'm going to scout around a bit. Yusuke looks over. Holy shit, a cat. It's weird how flashy that door is. And pretty is cool that a door lock? though. A door with a hefty lock. What could be in there? Why don't you uh go find out? <sighs> Are you done? It's no good. What does that mean? What? I'm sorry. Am I the problem? No, not at all. It's just I'm having trouble staying focused today. It's probably because we're in the room. I'm sorry, but we'll have to resume this another time. Oh, hell no! How many hours do you think you made us wait? I have no idea. 
I'm sorry. We had another reason for seeing you today. We needed to talk to you. It's about those rumors regarding your sensei. This again. Hear us out. In that painting I saw at the exhibit. You're the one who actually painted it, right? That's... Uh... He's been caught? Knew it. Your sensei seriously messed up. He just thinks of his pupils as tools. That's why he doesn't give a damn whether he steals their work or physically beats them. Reggie, shut the clear. fuck up, please. No point in hiding stuff from us. We need to be calm about this. I have no idea what you're talking about. You couldn't go against him, could you? I'm sure we can help you out, though. Stop uh, it. You guys are probably getting the wrong idea. It's just as you all say. We're our sensei's artwork. Never mind. Don't misunderstand me, though. I offered my ideas to him myself. As such, it can't be called plagiarism. You could have just said that from the beginning. Sensei is simply suffering from artist's block right now. How long has he been suffering from artist's Still. block? Still. <sighs> Kitagawa-kun. Then why are you sticking around? Ryuji, All his stop. other pupils ran away. Aren't you the only one left? He has nowhere else to go, dumbass. What's wrong with a pupil helping out his master? There are no victims here. Stop pushing your self-centered righteousness on me. Uh, and the other pupils? I'm supporting Sensei as his pupil. Where's the wrong in that? Nothing. Don't ever come here again. Unless he's doing something you really do, bad. I'll sue you for causing a disturbance. Hold it! We're not done talking here. Weirdy, you're gonna get sued. They Shut up. Leave me with no choice. Hey. I'm reporting you to the police. Please don't. I asked Hakamaki-san to be my model today, but I don't recall ever calling you two here. Cause she never told <laughs> you. Man. Ryuji, stop it. Yeah, Ryuji, calm down. Calm down, okay? Yes, please. I won't report you, but only under one condition. What is that condition? What's that? I want you to continue being my model, Takamaki-san. Weren't you gonna do that anyway? But you said that it wasn't working out today. That's because I was unconsciously being modest for your sake. However, uh oh. I have nothing to worry about anymore. If you are willing to bear everything to me, I will put my heart and soul into creating the best nude painting ever. What? Nude? Ah. Uh. To think I'd be able to create a nude painting with my most ideal model. You scared? Of course, Stop. you two won't be allowed in, and I ask that you forget about our discussion today as well. If I don't submit a new piece to Sensei soon, there will be some inconveniences. You scared? Think about this. Meaning it'll be without any clothes, right? Why are things suddenly escalating like that? You scared? Because those are my terms. But that's. You scared? Wait. Ain't that bad? This is like Since blackmail. During the afternoon while the art exhibit is on, so I can use this place freely. I should buy more art supplies. Yusuke. Will you give me a second here? Uh, of course. I'm willing to wait. Yusuke. I'll make time according to your plans. But please come before the exhibit ends. Yusuke. No, that's not what I mean. Why are you not listening? Sensei will be returning home soon. We're I recommend that you get the hell out of here. Lucky son, I'll be waiting for you to contact me. No, no, no. We are not done talking here. Goodbye. Be <laughs> like time to blackmail these kids. Well, we got to leave. Yeah. Damn it. He got He's good. he's actually going to blackmail us. Don't give up so easily. On <laughs> getting blackmailed again. Huh? Is she done Cat? the model? Cat? Fool! Moron. You've been caught. He's totally out of his mind. I'm gonna have to pose nude if this keeps up. So let's stop the it right there. It's not gonna be semi, but full on nude. Reggie, you didn't need to say that. Uh, 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 full nudity. Uh, Lady On's gonna drop it. You know, Please. you won't have to worry about that if we make Madarame confess before the exhibit ends. Yeah, let's speedrun his palace in one day, like Kamashita. Is there a need to make Madarame confess? Yes. Then, Lady On, you're fine with bearing it all? I 
am not. She didn't say that. Madarame is no different from Kamoshida. That asshole's using Yusuke, who doesn't have parents. You're telling me we should just ignore how we're gonna blackmail Madarame to make Yusuke stop no. blackmailing us. It is frustrating. It's a round robin of blackmail. Even if Kitagawa Kun is fine with it himself, you can't leave it be because you've endured a lot yourself with Kamoshida. Wow. Yeah. Deep. Anyways, we gotta go after this guy. Madarame is the kind of target we've been waiting for. Let's help Whoa. Yusuke come to his senses too. Before he ends up like us. Pretty sure he's like us already. We need to look into Madarame first. There might be tons more stuff that hasn't been exposed yet, too. So let's it go into the palace. To investigate his palace if he's preoccupied with his exhibit. Why? Also, there's the thing about me modeling. We can deal with that later. Kun said there'd be inconveniences unless he submits a new piece. Oh yeah. Maybe that's going to be announced soon as Madarame's next work. Does that mean the whole country's gonna see you nude? Well, not necessarily. That's just, we, that's just if we fail. It might not show your face. That's not exactly that what I was make referring me feel to. Any better about it? We must deal with Madarame, no matter what. Before his exhibit ends. Let's start after school tomorrow. We have oh, a deadline. It'll be a pain if Miss President finds us on the rooftop again. So, uh, where to meet up? Let's see. I guess that walkway-like place in Shibuya would work. It's near Madarama's place too. Changing our hideout periodically, huh? That's a plan I don't mind backing. Oh yeah. We've moved. Hey, uh, can I talk to you kids for a sec? Yo, what up? Huh? From the looks of things, you don't seem like the ordinary stalking fans. Yeah, we're high school students. Uh, oh, sorry. I should have been more clear. I'm actually looking for people that know Madarame's pupils. Oh, this you're in luck. That was supposedly stolen in the past. Oh, there's shit. There's this rumor that it was taken by one of his pupils in retaliation for being abused. Have you heard anything about that? Uh, Ryuji knows. Me? I don't know nothing. I see. There's no case unless there's a victim, and if there's no proof of abuse, I can't write either. Looks like I'm back to square one. Sorry for taking your time. No problem. I'm a journalist. If you ever get any leads, mind contacting me here? That's fine. I'll do that in like then. three hours. Actually, be more like I guess we should go home for today. See you in two months. Both in game and real life. Whatever, I still can't forgive him. Demanding to pay paint Lady on nude, then claiming to report us to the police. That's called blackmailing. Hey, it's me. Got a minute? Who the fuck are you? How did you get my number? No, I'm joking. I have some interesting news. Someone who received a change of heart contacted me on the fan site. <gasps> Pog? wants to meet with you to discuss another person who needs a change of heart. Pog? Uh, another change of heart? You're better off talking to him in person if you want specifics. All I know is his target is a terrible person. And that it might complicate things if he posted the name online. I'll have him wait for you at Shibuya Station after school. Oh boy, I wonder who it could be. The guy's name is Nakanohara. <gasps> no. No way. Nakanohara. That's Madarame's student. How did you hear that from all the way over there? I told him to approach you. You're a Mementos Pog. Good luck. We're not going into Mementos. Why would we go into Mementos? I found out something insane about Madarame. Sounds like a student of his offed himself when he couldn't speak up about Madarame stealing his work. Is that true? A journalist was looking into Madarame too. It could be real. Someone died though. No one's talking about it. I bet it was covered up. I wonder if Kotaku couldn't have heard anything. It'd be great if he could help us out. Good ears. <laughs> Ain't that asking a bit much? After today, he's probably going to be on edge about us. Well, anyway, Madarame is still a piece of crap. Let's meet up tomorrow. It'll be the first time at our new hideout. It's that passageway in Shibuya, right? Got it. See you guys tomorrow. If the rumor Ryuji just spoke of is true, there have to be other victims. Fair. Plant? Nice. Fuck. What can we do? Can we do anything? We can't really leave. Lockpicks? 
Okay. Pick locks. More of them. We have exactly enough to make three more. We go to mementos later. Yes. Yeah. Yeah. We get that proficiency up. Well There we go. We're already going. Yo. Yo. We're about to head to the hideout too. Okay. Who's that? Who do you think it is? Excuse me. That's Nakanohara. Mishima told us to meet him here in Shibuya today. Yo, what up? For real? For real. My name is Nakanohara. Yo, what up? Suiko Nakanohara. The one who was posted about on the Phantom Aficionado website. Yeah, we stole we stole he your treasure in Mementos. Nice. It doesn't seem like the stalker type. I think the change of heart must have worked. The administrator of that website contacted me. They told me to look for someone in a Shujin uniform with a cat. Yep, that I'm pretty so, much the only one who fits that want? description. You may have already heard, but there's someone I wish to trigger a change of heart in. An artist by the name of Madarame. Let's go. <gasps> you think this is it? Is the pupil gonna confess his master's secrets? His shadow did mention Madarame as well. It did. I'm one of Madarame's former pupils. We kind of gathered that. Lodging at his home, where I thought only about art. I genuinely wanted to be an artist. There was another pupil as well. A very talented man. Multiple years my senior. Obviously, Madarame kept tabs on him. Everything he made was claimed as a Madarame original. He wasn't the only victim, though. Right. We got some real proof of the plagiarism. In response to Madarame's actions, that senior pupil committed suicide. Oh, no. Suicide? He must have been unable to bear seeing his work praised under Madarame's name. That was when I disobeyed Madarame's orders and left. But he quickly pressured other parts of the art world, and my life as a painter was destroyed. At least you're a government worker now, though. I tried though. to turn over a new leaf working at a ward office, but it was no use. My attachment to art warped my emotions. Soon I began getting attached to everything. In the end, I even turned into a stalker. <laughs> I see. I'd That's like your backstory. Again. Please. Make Madarame have a change of heart. Not only for me. It's to save the life of another man as well. Save their life? Who could you possibly Even be talking now, there's about? There's still one young man remaining under Madarame's tutelage. I think he's about your age. That has to be Yusuke. No shit. Not only is he a talented artist, he also owes Madarame for taking him in after his mother passed. He is the perfect target. So Yusuke's got no choice but to listen. How do you know him? him a few times <laughs> back when I was still living at Madarame's. I asked him if he found it painful to stay with Madarame. And you know what he said? If I could leave, I would. You see, that was probably a couple years ago. I have no right to say this given my prior cowardice. But I don't want to see another suicide. You have full right to, to say that. To save this young man. He has a bright future ahead of him. Please consider that when thinking about changing Madarame's heart. So this guy knows who the Phantom Thieves are. He's like, oh, I saw these three people. I, these guys must be the Phantom Thieves. It sounds like we don't have the time to deliberate whether or not to change Madarame's heart. A lot of people know who the Phantom Thieves are. Let's save you, Skay. Hell yeah! Hell yeah! just a piece of shit who preys on the weak. Suicide. I'll never let something like that happen. Plus, we finally got to hear how Kitano Kun really feels. It is wild. Well, since we've reached a unanimous decision, how about we continue this at our new hideout? He was surely like, these kids are phantom thieves. And he was right. Thieves, he welcome was. Welcome to our new hideout. Yay. Time is a public opening. House. Public space. Pay dearly if as a hideout. just going to be like the last one. And furthermore... Lady An's chastity is on the line. Okay, Morgana, get back in the bag. What? We'll need to do what we did with Kamoshida. First, we secure an infiltration route in the palace. After that, we send Look at Joker's slouch. Once the treasure has materialized, we steal it. 
Oh, oh, I got a question. Uh, Madarame doesn't know that we were doing stuff in the past. Ryuji yet? being Klaus. We're already getting treated like criminals in there. You're learning, Ryuji. Well done. He's learning. He Any unknown person may as well be an enemy. Or maybe okay. he's just super salty from all those rumors that have been spreading about him. Yeah, he's probably super salty as well. Us being so crazy had nothing to do with us. No. Either way, we should stay on our best behavior. He literally be doesn't know we exist. Steal the treasure if we needlessly increase the security level. We need to be careful of Kitagawa-kun this time too. I'm sure that whatever he sees will just get passed on to Madarame. This is why we're not it's gonna right. let him know. Hey. What is Matarame's treasure going to look like anyway? Another crown? Who knows? I doubt that, but my sixth sense will know when I see it. Oh yeah, you go completely nuts, huh? He goes bonkers. Our time limit is when the exhibit ends, right? That means June fifth. We'll carry Damn. out the plan after we've sent out the calling card. So our infiltration route will need to be set in stone two days prior on June second. Now listen here. We can't mess this up, no matter what, okay? Okay, jeez. Calm down. Okay. This is the first job for the bitches! <laughs> I forgot I named us the bitches. <laughs> Alright, with that with that bombshell, I'm gonna go get a drink of water. I'm gonna run a one uh, a one one minute ad break while I go get that. is over <laughs> but if you don't want to watch a one minute ad break and chill in the chat while I go get a water you can always subscribe using twitch prime <laughs> anyway I'm back we're gonna uh, and we're gonna I, did okay, I need to do this no start the strategy meeting. that's it for that meeting we're gonna infiltrate okay, let's go Cause this this palace is kind of unique in the sense that we have to come back anyway. We can't do it all in one day. Now then, we're gonna go infiltrate. But the real question is, what are we changing we into? Something. And I'm gonna save. But we're gonna change our appearance. What do I change it to? I'm not sure. Give me something. Something to change it into. As we vibe to the music. Oh yeah. I don't know. I, I really don't know what to change it into. Probably just the Ultramarine outfit, right? We're gonna get some Velvet Room uniforms.
definitely gonna give Morgana the long nose outfit. Check it. Sister? <laughs> Come inside. Our master would like discuss. a word with you. Come in. Alright, sis. <laughs> I love how I turned it myself into the velvet room. And we are going. Mm -hmm. So you've come. Your rehabilitation seems to be going smoothly. Thanks to you, Igor. Excellent. I expect I've bonus. prepared a special gift for you. I must reward with such exemplary conduct. Use this power well. We got traits. <laughs> Pokemon abilities? Our, ki our master is extending incredible kindness. Shed tears of joy, inmate. <laughs> Your personas are born from the masks of your heart. They come in all manner of shape and sizes. You must master the inner workings of each persona to draw out its power. Do that and they will surely be of great use to you on your journey to rehabilitation. Then. If you have no other business, you may tend to it now. Any other business, you may tend to it now. Do we have any business here? I don't think so. Do you need something? I don't need anything. Let me out of here. Take me away. The intuished perfusion. I can't oh, level twenty seven. I'm waiting for a specific moment in time. For done already. What? I want to go back. It is time, inmate. Familiarize yourself with the many f forces of the heart that dwell within you. Doing so will propel you to greater heights and give you strength as you work towards your rehabilitation. Go forth. I have high expectations for you. We have emerged. Hey! Joker? Come on. <laughs> what are you standing around for? Get with the program, alright? You're a vital member of the team here. <laughs> We're gonna be like. I really do like these uniforms. The Velvet Room uniforms. They look very nice. We're collecting. I have oh man, that one's still stolen. This is so sad. We're in. We're in. The velvet attendants are in the base. Do 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 do. Oh, fuck. Hold on, Joker. It's an infrared laser device. If we touch it, the security oh, will increase. Man. Hold on, there wasn't anything like this last time, though. The rumors might slowly be making Madoreme more wary of us. Joker, they're not easy to see, but you should be able to do it with your skills. Be careful. I mean, I could just, you know, do that. Enemy spotted. can't touch me. I'm on the other side of this laser gate. Yo, what up, bitch? I'll reveal your true form. Now this enemy's weak to win. I see. Good music. Scary how good I am. Take him out. That music is really good. Okay. I can see it. Huh? Oh. That was a little too easy. Was it now? <gasps> Enemy! We are the better team. It's almost scary how good I am. Lend me your power. Look at it, glumping around. <laughs> better not make any wise cracks with this one. Better not? Uh it's for self-improvement. It's no fun going home. Uh, parents are annoying. Boom! I'm. We did it. We got a new persona. Joker is so smug. This. Oh God! This music. 
All right. This is so sad. Alexa played Despacito. I'll reveal your true form. You see, if I had Ryuji's insta kill ability, I'd be able to fucking murder these idiots. But instead, I have to do that. I'm gonna be weak to my fists in a minute. Oh shit. Fuck him up. I could have just rushed him. Nice work, team. Oh shit, so much money. Didn't even break a sweat. Okay, um. Oh no. He's gone. What the fuck? What? Huh? It's somewhere. What? What? I'll reveal your true form. Customer service fight outfits. They're good outfits. I don't see a weak spot. Sarah's Mafia. If you don't see a weakness, go for the crit. Go the crit. Morgana? Crit him. Hog. Fuck! Who's next? Stylish. <laughs> Dead. Right. I did not want to kill, I wanted to down and then steal. Oh let's go. Royal content, baby. Stylish as fuck. I played through the original game without using any outfits, and I thought, why not in this playthrough we'll use some outfits. Press this button so we don't have to go through that horrible maze again. Apologies for screaming in it. ear, in ears, just in, in general really loudly. Your true form. <laughs> what have I ever done to you? I don't, I don't know. What have you done to me? Him up. I missed. That is extremely sad. I can't believe you missed that. Uh, let's go, Ryuji. No. Ryuji was not supposed to kill there. He's confused? Give me the money. I should have used wind. This is fine. Losers. Yeah! Victory! We take We take we take W's here. We don't take L's. I can feel L's are not in my alphabet. Enemy. I'll reveal your true form. We're like kind of grinding it out because Merciless is a very difficult thing. Just straight up die. Okay, I'm using Lucky Punch to see if I can get a fucking crit. We hit a Garu. Get him out. Get him down. And then we Lucky Punch. Bonk. Why won't you die? What if I use some electricity? Oh, he's weak to electricity. Uh, I want an item because I have a lot of money. That's no, that's a good item, Mogana. What the fuck? What are you talking about? Soul Drop gives me SP, which is what I need. Okay. I don't know, I don't know if that grinding is fun to watch. I don't know. Because of how amazing I am at it. But we'll be in unknown territory once we go past here, right? Security will probably get a little more fierce as well. Make sure you don't touch anything or run into any of the displays, alright? What are you looking at me for? Because you're gonna run into an somewhere. Forget touching! I touch. What the 
fuck is that noise? What is that noise? Anyway, you can just hold down R2 and you'll automatically slide under those. Kind of useful. Is there a safe room anywhere nearby? Like, uh, there it is. Sweet. I'll just add this. Safe room acquired. I kind of just need to save at every safe room I get because I'm not gonna. It's gonna be difficult if I don't. I can see it. We play as safe. We we do a smug little slide. How did he see me? That one's strong. Oh, I don't see a weakness. Oh, 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 oh no. Let's go. There. Boo-foo. He's frozen. Nuclear. Persona. Fuck off. Finish it. Okay, what are they weak to? What are they weak to? I don't see a weakness. Mm. What are they weak to? What do they have? Nuclear. Do we have anything that resists nuke? No. So they want to have something that will resist. Kind of like you. So fire. They're not weak to fire. What do I do? Curse? No, they're not. They're probably not weak to curse, right? I stand correct. In the depths of my mind, I was like, yeah, they're weak to curse. Help me. No. Let's go, I leveled up. It's a step forward. We're level 14. Show me that move sometime. Okay. Wait, now I have an electricity move All on right, that guy. Best Treasure. guy ever. Best best persona. An atom ring. How do I get up there? Not right now. I need to be uber careful. I'll reveal your true form. Cause there was big, powerful guy. Leaf man, leafy old man. I don't want to guard. Gun. Gun is. They're not weak to gun. They're not weak to gun. Not weak to wind. Kind of assume that they're weak to fire. Let's go, level up. Alright. They were too weak to bother. Okay, I need to be careful. There's a guy Shadow here. I'll reveal Let's your fuck him up. Form. I just realized how low Mogana's health is. Oh no. I don't see a weakness. I believe you're weak to nuke. If I remember correctly. And I don't have one of those. Hmm. This might be a problem. What I could do. Is escape. You ready? <laughs> we don't have to deal with him. <laughs> it's all part of my master plan. Oh, what an idea. To get up here for no apparent reason. What is the point it. of being here? Aha! Uh -huh. Treasure chest spotted. Let's hope. How do we get back up? Is there a reason? Oh, I kind of have to go down here. All right, bitch is back. 
so we're going to heal Morgana. Do we have any uh Hmm Don't have any of that shit. Could equip a Adam Ring on Joker just to get that nuclear shit done. Or what I can do is I can pull out the I don't have any skill cards. Where are my skill cards? I thought I had skill cards. <laughs> Shit. Alright. Well, who's a better person to have that? Joker needs the XP. Morgana. Ryuji. I really hope that we need to nuke. I'm trying not to run through here, so I don't alert this guy. Now's our chance to strike. Okay. Let's go. Bring down his defense. <laughs> I need to bring down there this guy. We can get a lucky punch off. Oh no. You gotta be shitting me. I almost clicked the wrong skill. I knew it. We're gonna get fucked. Uh oh. Concern. Not good. It blocks. Thank you, Ryuji. Okay, if I break formation, I give me baton pass, I could heal Morgana. Or, you know, I could just hit him again. And then I heal Ghana. Playing dead isn't easy. Witness my resolve. Take this. God damn. Come on. Not good. Morgana is dead again. I got too reckless. I'll back out and focus on support. This should not be difficult. Oh, you bitch. Let's go, Captain. That was incredible, Skull. We win these. Not even close. Hell yeah! A new move! Morgana just doesn't right. get XP. I don't actually know how that works. But we're back in business, baby. We you couldn't get the uh the Atom Ring back. Uh, can get the I think it's the team glasses back on. I can see it. Everything's coming up. Uh, a okay. Press button. Hit that, and we can come through here whenever we need to. I'm gonna save. Wait. Yes, I'm going to save. Just in case. I don't want to die. I'll just add this. I would prefer it if I did not die. Come on. Fucking smug joker. Man, the door is closed again. I just gotta get halfway, basically. Focus. I'm focused. I gotta admit, this is a pretty big location. Oh yeah. Let me in. What a cool pot. Hey, wait a second. 
You're just gonna ignore that golden sheen? It's not a treasure. Mm, look at that luster. I know it might be tough to take with us, but don't you think it'd sell for tons? It's it's not real. Uh, we didn't come here to wait, hold on, you're stepping on something. Fool. Isn't this bad? Stand back. Oh no. I tripped the security. Morgana, this is your fault. Uh, you were the one making us be careful too. So what do you want to do? Run out of here? No, passing through all of these lasers will draw far too many enemies to our location. Oh, hold on! Joker's not trapped! Yeah, I'm reliable. Sorry, Joker, but we're going to need you to search for a way to turn off these infrared lasers. This is a museum, so there has to be some switch to let the workers avoid these lasers. Find it. Thanks, Morgana. Okay, well, the obvious direction is in this direction. There's a bitch there. I don't want to fight him. I do not remember. It's right there. I see it. I really don't want to get attacked by this guy. <laughs> Piss off. Piss off. <laughs> Leave me alone. Arm. Welcome back. You fool! Hello? I'm gonna juke the fuck out of him. Never mind. <laughs> this is not good. So glad I saved. <laughs> oh my god, I just got one I got one fucking shot. <laughs> Damn it on. Damn it Morgana, this is your f your fault. You did this. Lesson learned if you get spotted, fucking fight him. There's no point getting ambushed. You're gonna get fucked. So we just run through. Pretend that didn't happen. I can feel it. Speed run, speed run, speed run, speed run. God, a Persona Five. The Persona Five speed runs are so long. All right. To this thing. Oh, you actually have to climb over this. There's a bit of glass there that prevents you. Just gotta wait. I don't want to ambush because I'm gonna get fucked. I mean, I could. I do have wind skills, right? I don't actually have a wind skill. So yes, it would be death Focus. if I ambush this guy. Where's the button? Oh, you! Goodbye. <laughs> I don't want to fight you right now. I don't know what you're weak to. I'm pretty sure it's psychic. Panther, you bitch. Seriously, thank you. I have to talk to you. That makes a lot of sense, actually. Okay, now we have two people, which means I can actually do things. 
All right, we go have to we have to get to that painting. Hmm. It hasn't spotted us. We can totally get it. Is this press? Just look out for the dickhead behind us. Yeah. Okay. Let's go. Sorry. We dodged him. All right, now we have to turn the lasers off. Stealth mode. Cool. <laughs> Vent mode. Where am I? <laughs> Whoa! Wait. Let's go. Suspicious. Where? Ah. Yeah. Let's find the password. Wow. Yo, what up? Hello. Anyway, he's just told us the password. Hey. We can get the hell out of here. Yeah. Lasers deactivated. Nice. We pop off. He's gone. Everyone is gone. Sorry. That was very much unlike me. Sheesh, weren't you going? Weren't you the one telling us not to go around touching shit in the exhibit? Uh, that is true. I can't believe I made such a novice mistake, even for solid gold. But something was drawing me to this vase. Hmm. What do you mean? It's just. Isn't it just an ordinary gold vase? I wonder if there's something special about it. Should we take a closer look, just in case? Hmm. Close look. Big jewel. Wait. What is this? For real? Oh, I see. That's why I was drawn to it. Joker, catch it! I'll explain the rest of this later. Just get after it and attack. It's a regent. Die. <laughs> Wait, I. Why did I do that? I'm a fool. A foolish fool who fooled. I need a crit. Let's go. Or like, wait, isn't he weak to wind or something? I don't have wind. Some other way. And I don't want to find out. Can I please get a crit on this guy, please? Please. I would like a critical hit. This is so sad. Out of the way. No. Guess I had him. Coming. Music is how I feel right now. Mm. Oh, I got away. What was that? That panther was a rare shadow I occasionally that re occasionally resides in pricey items. I call them treasure demons. They're great. Not only do they give you a lot of experience, they may be useful for your personas too. However, they run very fast, and attacks don't deal much, very much damage to them. I was, I, I fucked up. That was my fault. And a safe room. Thank you. I need that. I can't believe I got one shot. I'll just add this. Yo, money enemy. It's so sad. You're very behind. Anyway, I can see it. <gasps> no way! The hell? How are we supposed to get past this huge hole in the? Calm down. Look at where the security guard is walking. It's actually fake. Yo, what up? Leafman. weak to fire skills. I can see that. This one's weak to electricity. They're all weak to fire skills. Panther. No! This is so sad. Mm, Ryuji. 
Fucking die. Bufu! Oh no! Luckily I save. This is why you save. <laughs> oh, as soon as I saw that firewall, I was like, oh no. <laughs> uh oh. <laughs> Didn't know I was weak to ice skills. Yikes. This way. Yeah, we can't go through there, so we have to come up through here. Luckily, it was right here all along. I'll reveal your true form. We get that drop on him now. Alright, the first move is ours. It's weak to fire skills. Is it though? Next is Ryuji, but is that really necessary? Weak to fire skills. Is this gonna go Oh, it's not gonna go exactly the same. Arten's faster because we had we got the drop on him this time. Nice job, Who's we took them all out. Man. I take out enemies in one shot, they take me out in one shot. <sighs> Give me Why does she react to this stuff? Cut it out. I'm just getting cool shit. Oh, this is so sad. In the original Persona 5 game, this was like double sided, but it was really clear. And you could see out the door. It was really funny. Like, both of them you could see outside the door. And it was just all clear, like the aesthetic, whatever it's form. called. Anyway, once we get to the halfway point, I think I'm gonna stop. Oh no. No bang bang bang! Oh, uh, bang again. It's almost scary how good I am. Again. Well, they're not weak to that. And they're not weak to that. So how about I just go? Bonk. Oh no. Oh no. I'm dead. This is where I die. No. <laughs> Man. I'm just rushing into things. I shouldn't be. I shouldn't be rushing. That's my problem there. I keep rushing into battles being like, I'm the best! Where they can kill me one shot. Get back here. I missed him. Holy shit! You have to play it really safe. This is so scary. Okay. Good work. <sighs> Terrifying. Cut it out. Cut it out. All right, let's beat up this guy this time. Successfully. I'll your true form. One in there. No! You can't tell. Okay. Sure. What would they be weak to? Oh yeah. I forgot. I know what they're weak to. Oh, I can't. If I if I had somebody else. And then we send Ryuji in. 
And then we go BOOM! <laughs> One shot, baby, with the shotgun. A spectacular victory! We did it. Okay. It's somewhere. This is always a suspicious room. How close are we? Well, that's a wheel will seat room. Oh, we're actually I think we're actually really close. Stealth machine? Stealth maneuvers? Hello, librarian. I don't know, whatever they're called. Oh, an easy one. Not over yet. They're not weak to fire. We use the one that's weak to fire. Oh, but I can get items from this. I can get... Give me item... No harm. M. I get it, because it says no harm and stuff. But I don't know what it does. Now I don't think I've ever treat. used one. I never use Go Home M either, which is short for okay. Go Home. It's funny. I'm not sure, but Focus. you know what I mean. Oh no! Huh? Intruders in the second exhibition room. Apprehend them at once. Oh no! Enemies. <laughs> Crap! Let's get out of here fast. Which way's the exit? We hide, Show and we ambush. This, this is probably a powerful enemy. Never mind. What are you weak to? Fire as well. Interesting. I wish I was level 15, but I'm gonna get him now. Gonna get level 15. Please give me level 15 right now. Damn. All right. There is a set. There is another. We take him out. We're good. That was very scary. I'm so good. Oh, SP cost reduced. That's epic. Kill him. Stab them all. Die! We are the best. Level 15. I leveled up. This is too sad music. Can you move? You did it! <laughs> Let's okay. go. Well, you defeated I can them. It. Okay. I don't have to worry going. about anything. No enemies. I'm over here. What does this do exactly for me? I think I was supposed to go somewhere else. Hmm. I feel like I'm not just oh I'm I'm not supposed to just go there, right? Oh wait, <laughs> this small button. Let's go forward then. Oh, good. Oh, we yes. are where I thought we are. Whoa. Oh, come on. Oh, it's even gaudier than the rest of the museum. 
It definitely looks like something important would be hidden away in there. Let's go. Let's go find out. Uh. Holy shit. Whoa! The hell? Are these infrared lasers? There's no way we can get past them. This level of security only proves there's something worth protecting up ahead. Wait, there's something written on the sign. All personnel, this door can only be opened via the security room that lies beyond it. Please be cautious oh. as it is impossible to open from the outside. Oh no. So it's never gonna open? How are we supposed to get past? You don't? Wait, that door. I think I've seen that pattern somewhere. Oh, right. There's no mistaking it. That's the same door I saw earlier. Ah, uh, yes, the MacGuffin. Guys, let's head back. Huh? Why? I think I know what real world door that's based on. There may be another way to open it. In any case, I'll explain later. Come on, let's go. Yep, this is as far as we can get in the palace today. We have to split the palace into two. Which means I'm going to split dealing with the palace into two as well. Because I'm starting to get tired and I need to save my energy. I still have things I want to do. So we're going to... We're going to save here. Because that's a good idea. And we're going to exit. We did like half of that. Well. Oh. How are we supposed to get past that door? Good question. I don't know. You think there's some kind of off switch somewhere? Looks like this is where I come in. Mona? I have a suspicious place in mind. You're really speedrunning this game, huh? This shack is the base. I mean I've played it before. <laughs> I actually scouted it out the last time we were here. Whoa. So and it's really your plan well not start? easy to beat. Correct. But like it's possible to you beat all the palaces in one go. Except for, you know, this so one where you literally physically place? can't. It's on the second floor. I noticed an unnaturally hefty lock on Cuz this is story. If it's locked, that means there's something in there he doesn't want people to see. But don't we want to be opening the door in the palace? But no, I'm not yes. speedrunning this game necessarily. We're going to do that by I'm just doing real really well. In front of Madarame's eyes. Basically, we're going to change his cognition that the door is unopenable. In other anyway, words, yeah, they're talking about opening the, the unopenable door. House, so that area in his palace will open on its own. I'm not really getting it. Uh, is that gonna work? Yes, Ryuji. There's no chance it won't open. I think. You think. You understand, don't you, Joker? Perfectly. It can't hurt to try. Well, yeah, but... What do you mean, but? Why don't you trust me? It's worth a try. But even then, there's still that hefty lock we have to deal with in reality, right? Ugh, oh, that'll be a breeze. Just give me a hairpin and I'll handle it. It will take some time, though. You're a cat. Doing everything by myself in front of Madarame would be impossible. If only there was someone who could distract him for a while. Well. Huh? Oh. Oh. Sounds like you're going in. How are we even going to get into his house? <laughs> We'd get reported for sure if we force ourselves in. What? I guess the only way is having you go nude. What? Fancy you say that, Ryuji. I was just thinking the same thing. This isn't funny! <laughs> We're not saying you should really get naked. It's simply the best excuse for you to enter Madarame's house without raising suspicions. So we'd like for you to play the role of decoy, Lady An. This is way too sudden! I mean, I don't even know where the locked door is! You don't need to know. Don't worry. It's on a need-to-know basis. And you don't need to know. technically only me! Worst comes to worst. What if I get found out? Run. We can run into the palace. Or something. Is that really gonna work? 
I mean, you're not giving me much confidence in this plan. Do I have to be the bait? There's no other way. But what if, you know, uh, um, nothing. All you gotta do is trick Yusuke, have him take you to that room, then just open the door. You make it sound so easy. I mean, it kind of is. If there's no other way. You're just letting a cat walk in. You're j bringing a cat in. Cat come and go to the door. Pick the door lock. And you go, oh no, my cat just picked the lock to your door. Oh no. If it's for your sake, Lady On, I won't stop scratching even if all my claws were to break. I wouldn't do anything though. We'll be counting on you, Morgana. Don't let Yusuke notice you, alright? If he tries to force my clothes off, I'll tear that house down. Calm down. I'm really gonna lose it if we do all this and the palace door doesn't open. Got it? Fair? We're working to but get calm down. that guy's crimes either way. It won't go to waste. Alright, let's get down and dirty tomorrow. Tomorrow? Tomorrow? Um, but this guy really wants me to go in tomorrow. I don't know. Just say something like, I really need it to be tomorrow. That should Ryuji? work. Yeah. Yo, what up? Okay. I'm home. You get in touch with Yusuke? Mm-hmm. He come out. He asked me to come by tomorrow. Oh yeah, he fell for it. Um, do I really have to do this? Strip for her, man. <laughs> I am not stripping. Man, this is such a pain. We gotta open that door and have Madarome see it, right? Yeah. Morgana said that will change his cognition. Cognition. I don't get it. Oh, and one more thing. <laughs> Let us know if any weird shit goes down, and we'll be there to back you up ASAP. Got it. A palace is a reflection of how its owner views the real world. We do a little, so we do a little trolling. So if cognition of reality changes, it's only natural that his palace would be affected. And all jokes aside, we really will need Lady On to strip for Yusuke. It's the only way. Let's do it. So I'm gonna stop there, I think. I'm gonna save the last half, next half of the palace for next time. Cause I'm getting tired and I have work tomorrow, you know? So it's kind of one of those days. So thank you for joining. If you haven't, or have, if you if you are not caught up with Persona 5 Royal playthrough, you can always go check out the vods at my vod channel, Wage Troll One. It's literally the same as this Twitch channel. And I hope to catch you on Tuesday. I don't know what I'm doing Tuesday, but I'm gonna do something. Goodbye.